Minneapolis, the Indians' depth is not only being tested on the infield with injuries to Francisco Lindor and Jason Kipnis, but in the starting rotation as well. There's nothing wrong with Corey Kluber, Trevor Bauer, Mike Clevinger and Shane Bieber, but their main replacement, Adam Plutko, opened the season at Class AAA Columbus on the injured list. Plutko strained his right forearm while pitching in a minor league game just before camp broke. He is expected to be sidelined for about three weeks. If anything happened to the Tribe's top five starters, Plutko would have been the first option from the minors. He made six trips between Columbus and Cleveland last year, replacing Josh Tomlin as the fifth starter for a time. Plutko went 4-5 with a 5.28 era in 17 games, including 12 starts, with the Tribe. Candidates for the rotation at Columbus are Chi Wei Hu, Cody Anderson, Jeffrey Rodriguez, Xiao Ching Chang and Asher Wojciechowski. They were all in big league camp with the Indians. The Indians released their four full-season minor league rosters Friday. Noah, Bo, Naylor, the Indians' number one pick last year, will open the year at Class A Lake County. Naylor, a catcher, hit .274, 32 for 117, with three doubles, two homers and 17 RBI for the Arizona Rookie League Indians last year after signing. The Indians drafted Naylor, 19, out of St. John of Arc High School in Ontario, Canada. Lefty Sam Hedges, who made a good showing in big league camp, will open the season at Class AA Akron. As will hard-throwing reliever James Karen Chick and outfielder Daniel Johnson. The Indians acquired Johnson as part of the Angoams deal, and he had an impressive showing in big league camp. Stan McKenzie, the tribe's top prospect, will open the season on the disabled list with a sore right shoulder. Outfielder Will Benson, the Indians know. One pick in 2016, returns to Lake County. Hit 22 homers with 58 RBI, but struck out 152 times in 416 at-bats last year. Is there a doctor in the house? The Indians are still waiting for a second opinion on Lindor's sprained left ankle. They're consulting Dr. Robert Anderson in Green Bay. The Indians are trying to get an idea on how much time Lindor will need to get ready to join the big league club. He spent all spring rehabbing a strained right calf.